Good evening and welcome to Compline on this Monday evening. Let's take that moment, as we always do, to calm our hearts and minds as we come to Compline with our Heavenly Father. O Christ, Son of the living God, may your holy angels guard our sleep. May they watch over us as we rest and hover around our beds. Let them reveal to us in our dreams visions of your glorious truth. O High Prince of the Universe, O High Priest of the Mysteries. May no dreams disturb our rest and no nightmares darken our dreams. May no fears or worries delay our willing, prompt repose. May the virtue of our daily work hallow our nightly prayers. May our sleep be deep and soft, so our work be hard and fresh. I will lie down and sleep in peace, for you alone, Lord, make me dwell in safety. My dear ones, O oh God, bless thou and keep in every place where they are. Into your hands I commit my spirit. I give it to you with all the love of my heart. How precious to me are your thoughts, O oh God, how vast is the sum of them. Were I to count them, they would outnumber the grains of sand. When I awake, I am still with you. I make the cross of Christ upon my breast over the tablet of my hard heart. And I beseech the living God of the universe, may the light of lights come to my dark heart from thy place. May the Spirit's wisdom come to my heart's tablet from my Saviour. Our reading for tonight is from 1 Chronicles 16, verses 11 and 12. Study God and his strength. Seek his presence day and night. Remember all the wonders he performed. Does it ever puzzle you how the strength and certainty you received from God yesterday or this morning was only sufficient for a while. That you need to keep going back to God in order to sustain your faith. You're not weak. The need to keep going back is actually evidence that your relationship with God is healthy. God has fashioned his encouragement this way because he wants you to return to him. He desires for you to speak with him often and continually draw from his grace. Go to him tonight, study him, seek his goodness and remember his power. Sustain your faith and strength and certainty by staying in the presence of God. Psalm 68 verse 19 says, Praise the Lord, God our Saviour, who helps us every day. Christ without sin, Christ of wounds, I am placing my soul and my body under thy guarding this night. Christ of the poor, Christ of tears, thy cross be my shielding this night, or thou son of tears of the wounds of the piercing. I am going now into the sleep, albeit in thy dear arms keep, O God of grace, that I shall awaken. And a short prayer as we move into a time of quiet. Dear God, I need you. Thank you for always giving me strength 
and that I can always go to you when I need my faith renewed. Amen. Let's say the words of the Lord's Prayer together. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power and the glory are yours, now and forever. Amen. My Christ, my Christ, my shield, my encircler, each day, each night, each light, each dark. My Christ, my Christ, my shield, my encircler, each day, each night, each light, each dark. Be near me, uphold me, my treasure, my triumph. Circle me, Lord, keep protection near and danger afar. Circle me, Lord, keep light near and darkness afar. Circle me, Lord, Keep peace within and evil out. The peace of all peace be mine this night. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Thank you again for joining me for Monday Compline. Please take care. Good night and God bless you and I'll see you again tomorrow. <laughs>